Did you feel that, mortal? Did you feel the catchiness of this title screen music? No? Because I do. I have been vibing to this music. Okay, I think five minutes before I hit recording and decided to, well, if I'm going to get hypnotized by this music and vibe to it, I will get you guys, viewers at home, together to vibe with me. Okay, we are going to get hypnotized together. <laughs> everyone and welcome back to my channel i'm riri and today we will be playing this game that you can see above my hat here it's called lil guardsman yes and thank you so much to the developer hilltop studios and the publisher versus evil for this amazing game and for giving me the opportunity to play this game in this channel okay say thank you guys you will not see me playing this game so soon if it's not because of them okay and yes i think let's not talk that much in the title screen okay let's run from this music before we are totally get hypnotized by this music so, alright, let's just start. Yes, new game. Mm hmm. Okay, let's start. And so it came to pass that the day mm -hmm. was to be saved by the most unlikeliest of heroes. Oh, I'm, I'm blocking the subtitle. Unwillingly thrust into the workforce. One disaster after another had been diverted due to her diligent and cunning decision making. With the king okay, of the crap, crap. knowing everlasting peace mm -hmm. and prosperity, our hero could finally rest their weary head. But only after one more critical decision was to be made. A decision of great weight. A decision of immense importance. A decision that could possibly kill <laughs> hundreds, even thousands of people. Oh my god, you've made the wrong choice. Oh. You two think things through. You've doomed us all. Everything's on fire now. We're all covered in fire. How could you have done this to us? What did I well, do? <gasps> okay. Well. Okay. It's not Leo. It's Re. Okay. Re. Re, yeah, it's Re Re Guardsman, not Lil Guardsman. Okay. Mm -hmm. What? Oh, Dad, I was. Oh, I must have been having a nightmare. Oh, hi! Oh, yeah, and I think her name is Lil because I have seen several posts on Twitter X and they keep calling her Lil. So, yes, nice to meet you, Lil. Mm hmm. It's over now, sweetie. But since you're awake, I think it's time you and I had the talk. The talk? The 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 talk? I don't want the talk. I want the money. That my daily allowance, please. I'm I'm assuming that he is her dad. Because they have the same well hair color, yes? And oh my god. I love the voice, okay? I love that they had voice acting in this game. Mm-hmm. Out of one nightmare and into another. <laughs> Out of one nightmare and into another. Oh, I love the voice. Mm-hmm. Sweetie, there comes a time in every young person's life. Mm-hmm. Oh, this is literally the start of the talk. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I love, I love how he says the talk. He manages to make it sound charming and funny at the same time, okay? Well, Dad, you don't have to do this. <laughs> yes, Dad, there is no need to do the talk, okay? There is the internet, okay? Just say the keyword and we will do the search. <laughs> Oh when they God, have to I work their dad shift at the guard shed while he places a bet on the goblin ball match down at the pub. Huh? Huh? 
When they have to work the last shift at the golf shop while he places a bet on the goblin ball match down at the pub, does that mean that that you want me to replace you in going to work? Is that how this is going? Mm-hmm. Aw, oh, Dad, do I have to? Today was the day I was going to start off on a grand adventure with my friends. I want to sail the open sea. I want to fight ogres. Ooh, I, ooh, ooh. I want to throw rocks at things. Ooh, what game are you going on about, little guardsman? Sail the open sea, fight ogres, throw rocks at things. What kind of video games that you want to play with your friends? Alright, well as much as I hate it, of course, I don't I, I also don't want to go to work in place of my dad, okay? You think I didn't want to throw rocks at things when I was your age? <laughs> but I had a duty. <laughs> I had a responsibility. <laughs> okay, alright. Guys, raise your hand in the comment section if you ever, ever want to throw rocks at things. Well, I would say at someone, but it's categorized as bullying and we do not condone any act of bullying here. So yes, if you ever feel like you want to throw rocks at things, raise your hand in the comment section so that I know how many of you that are a rebel at heart okay a devil spawn <laughs> yes i had to work at the guard shed while my dad placed a bet at the goblin ball match down at the pub <laughs> so that is the family tradition okay the coming of age ceremony work at the guard shed while your dad gambles yes Ooh, imagine if it happens nowadays, okay, in this age and time where you can bet online, <laughs> okay? So, yes, please go work at your dad's office while he's gachaing, okay, on his gacha game. Gachaing for his waifu that he two times your mother whip, yes. Whew, alright. Did he ever win anything? Uh, I don't think so. I think he lose the 50-50 chance. Do you think we'd be stuck here if he did? <laughs> oh my god! I love the writing in this game. I love the humor in this game. And yes, that I know. Do you think we would be stuck here if he did? Mmm, you're right. We, we have bad luck here, that. Mm -hmm. But I'm 12. Won't we get in trouble? Oh my gosh! You are 12? Recently, recently, I feel like I have been playing games with, well, 12 years old, 13 years old, and that shows how amazing children has become, okay? They can become, well, in a potion master in the other game that I was playing, Potions, A Curious Tale, and now we got this girl, 12 years old, going to replace her dad, working as a guard, wow! <laughs> Children grow so fast these days, okay? Not if we don't get caught. Come on, I'll show you how to handle anything that comes up. How can we not get caught, okay? We have, well, size difference at its finest, okay? He's huge and Lil is still just so small, okay? I don't want to offend you, Lil, but, well, you are Lil. Little, like little, little, yes. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> okay, this is going to be our first job, all right? Ah, look at that! Okie dokie, ready for me to very quickly show you how everything works? Uh, wait a moment, sir. I want to appreciate how cute Lil is, okay, sitting on that. Chair? Wait, don't tell me that you used to sit on that same chair as well, sir. No, I, I don't think, I don't think he did, okay? I don't think he sit there. I think he's just standing guard because he is a guard. So he is standing guard, I think. Mm-hmm. 
Oh good, everyone loves a tutorial. Yes, I love that. Okay, my dumb brain loves that, please. No time for a full rundown, so I'll sum it up like this. The key thing to remember when being a castle guardsman is... Oh no, no, I don't like summary. I mean, it has re behind it, but I don't like it. I want to be like summary re, okay? Full summary re, okay? Full, full summary, okay? Full explanation, detailed explanation written in Google Docs with a minimum of 5,000 words. 5,000 words, okay? Dad, someone's coming. What do we do? Huh? Huh? What do we do? What do we do? Honestly, honestly, I have seen people talk about this game and they say that this game has quite similar mechanic as Paper Please, yes. But here is the catch. I never play Paper Please, okay? So this is going to be a very, very new experience for me. <laughs> And yes, I'm so sorry if I do make what you would call beginner mistake, rookie mistake, yes? Please understand, okay? Don't don't roast me in the comment section. Uh, okay. Uh -huh. I guess the best way to learn is by doing. Let's just hope there's someone completely plain and boring. Okay. Let's just hope there's someone completely plain and boring. That's supposed to be me. Okay, if I'm not walking there, if I'm not walking into the screen, okay, please let it be me, okay? Someone completely plain and boring. That's me, okay? Uh huh. Ah, good morning, Mrs. Abernathy. How's your day today? Uh, 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 okay. Um, Mrs. Abernathy. Okay, Mrs. Abernathy. I don't want to insult you, ma'am. Oh, my kindest grandma, I don't want to insult you. But Mrs. Abernathy, by any chance, by any chance, are you someone who is boring and plain? Uh huh. Nope, she's not. Okay. Plain and boring, as always. Oh my god, she is? Oh my god, she is? You are not plain and boring, ma'am. I love your red scarf, okay? You are unique, okay? This thing, this thing, Tiff, okay? And yes, let's continue. Bingo. Would you mind if Lil looks after you? Huh? No? I mine. I mine. Oh, not at all. It's always a pleasure to see your daughter, Seamus. Okay, so his name is Seamus, okay? Alright, Grandma Abernathy, Seamus, and Lil. I'll try my best to remember all of you names, okay? It's Hamish. Oh, it's Hamish. Okay. <laughs> Okay, I thought it's really Seamus, okay? Hamish, yes. What is? Hamish, ma'am. Hamish, yes. Usually, usually when they can't hear you, when you speak loud, sometimes all you need is just a gentle treatment. A gentle whisper ASMR. Hamish, yes. Never mind. Now, Lil, when a visitor approaches the guard shed, they'll generally start by stating their business. Okay, starting their business, okay. And ma'am, what is your business coming to this little guard check? Plain and boring, okay, that's her business. I'd like to state my business. I bring a basket of baked goods to my son and his family mm -hmm. once a week. Oh, would you like one? I won! I won one! Please, please, open up, ma'am. Open up that basket, please. Uh, oh, yeah, we, we really get that. Thank you, you are so kind. Dad, is this bribery? I received cake from Grandma Abernathy. Is this a bribe? Tell me if this is a bribe. 
I'm 12 years old. I don't want to go to jail because I receiving bribe. 12 years old is not my age to experience corruption, Dad. Yes? Mm-hmm. Oh, I got... After uh, they state their business, yes, it's pretty okay. much your call what to do next. Huh? That's all? That's all? You can select them and interrogate them. There's tools, the phone there on the wall. You only get three action points. You get it, right? No, I'm dumb. But okay, interrogate them. All right, and then what What should I do with the phone? Who should I call? The police? I am the police, right? I work in the guard shack, so of course I'm the guard. So who should I call? Not really. What do we need tools for? True. What do we need tools for? And and why do you have shuriken up there? Okay, who's ninjas working here? You can pick one and it does something. Come on, Lil. I've really got to speed this along. The Goblin Ball game is about to start. She's 12 years old and I have 12 IQ. Okay, we are both 12 but in different kind of matters. We need more explanation. Thank you. <sighs> Alright. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm inconveniencing you? Yes, yes, roast your father, Lil. Okay, I think, I do think, the steps to becoming a teenager is when you have to, like, roast your parents just a little, okay? But when you manage to do that, that's like taking one step into the stage of teenagers. The most rebellious life stage of human, yes. Oh no, not at all, dear. I don't mind helping out. Uh-huh. But the princess is whirly gigging the ceremonial first slingshot. What is whirly gigging? What is whirly gigging? Whirly gigging. What is whirly gigging? Okay. Uh, oh, oh, wait. I, I got a call. Wait, wait a moment. Alright, so I just got a very important call. I'm so sorry, guys, that I have to pause the game a little bit. But I'm back now. And let's continue. <laughs> I am ready to interrogate Mrs. Abernathy more. Mm hmm Oh, and I think I may have click on that and it brings us to the next dialogue. Yes. Um, she is? Sweet jumping jitters, we got to get to that game. Let's wrap this up here. Shamies, tell the girl what to do. Yes, Shamies, tell me what do I should do. And then he's going to say, it's Hamish. The name is Hamish. <laughs> oh my god. You know, I love if you like really, really pay close attention to what he said. He's saying it in like a very, very patient way. Like, the name is Hamish. Like, he's been dealing with these things every day, okay? And he's just like, okay, that's fine. I think that's what I should do every day to Mrs. Abernathy. Remind her about my name, about what should she call me. Yes. All right. No, it's Mrs. Abernathy. <laughs> no, it's Riri, actually. All right. And select any highlighted element to learn about it. Okay. Um, what should I learn? Okay, mm, I don't know what I should learn though. And wait, did I already mention the attention to detail that this game has? I think I did or I did not. But yes, basically we have this CCTV camera right here. And if you like take a close look at this green screen, okay, you will see how it looks, okay? You will see that the camera actually monitors her and it shows in this screen. And I love this attention to details, yes. And alright, let's just check what I can do with each of these. The first one this phone is, is for the calling phone. the royal advisors and asking for their help. Huh? But all they really give you is their opinion. The royal advisor and asking for their help? Huh. 
Ah. Okay, let me try that. Let me try you that. You get a hold of Lieutenant mm -hmm. Striker, Captain of the Guards, and technically our boss. Okay, you can get a hold of Lieutenant Striker, Captain of the Guards, and technically our boss. All right, can Hello, I... who's there? Ooh, she's hot. <laughs> She is really hot. And yes, ma'am, it's me, Lil. And I want to ask because right now, at the time I'm recording this, we are having a Steam Spring sale, ma'am. And do you have any suggestion about what game that I should buy? Huh? What's that? Lil Guardsman. Yes, thank you for the suggestion, ma'am. I really appreciate it. Buy Lil Guardsman on Steam Spring Sale. Unfortunately, I think by the time this video goes up in my channel, I think the sale is already over. So just wishlist the game and wait until its next sale or you can just show your support and buy it on its full price, of course. Alright. Uh-huh, click. Okay, she turned that off on me. I'm sad. Or First Councilwoman Ash, the head bureaucrat of the sprawl with a real mind for politics. Okay, Ash. This is Councilwoman Ash. Mm -hmm. Hello? Hello, is somebody there? Uh oh, I think I think we are the one doing the prank call. Like we call them, but then we do not like elaborate. We just call them and then turn it off. I see. Alright, click. And finally, the royal jester Malcolm, chaos huh? personified in human form. No, no, no. Excuse me? Royal jester? Why would we need a royal jester in this game? Like, like what can he do? Is my joke not enough? Is that what you are saying? That my joke is not enough for this game? That they need someone else to help boost up the jokes? That's why we have Royal Jester in this game? And Chaos Personified in human form? You get Chaos Personified in vampire form right here! Why would you settle for a human when you can settle for inhuman creatures? I don't understand. I don't understand, Shamis. Yes? Hello, you've reached Malcolm. Please leave a message after the goose honk. Hey, uh -huh. where'd the goose go? Well, chase after it, for goodness sake. Don't chase after the goose. I can make the sound of goose myself, okay? Hong hong, quack quack, let's go. Each call costs an action point. Okay, action points, all right? Well, it's better than being charged like with real money, okay? And what's next? This you one? Use a wicked 3000 to make the big decision to let someone in or send them packing. Ooh, I see. Okay. Choosing this will end the tutorial. Can I finally get out of here? Not yet, Dad. Teach me more. Wait, there is more. Yes, please. Teach me more. What about Didn't this we one? Cover this? That's your inventory bag where mm -hmm. you keep the things people give you or that you confiscate from them. Ooh. In other words, your sweet, sweet loot. Mm -hmm. Looking in your bag for something to use doesn't cost you an action point. Okay, so basically, we can just open our inventory, okay, while we are hungry. Take a look at the cake, stare at it, and then close it again. I see. Alright, I see that works, okay. And what else? This one, maybe? Ooh, oh, what is that? If you want to use a tool, mm -hmm. you have to make sure it has a crystal to charge it. Here, I'll show you. Okay. I'll add this today's one? crystals to the tools that don't have any. That way, mm -hmm. I have a well-rounded arsenal. Oh, yeah. So, if it has this kind of icon, as you can see it right here, that means that they have crystals. They're charged up. And we can use that. I see. Why Ooh. do the other tools already have crystals in them? Yeah, yeah. Why did the other tools already have crystals? I carried them over from previous days. Any other questions? Oh, I see. So unused tools from the day before can be brought to the next day. You can use them on the next day. I see. Oh, that's convenient. I like it. Why does I a like bullwhip need uh -huh. to be powered by crystals? No, why do we have a bullwhip actually? This is the bullwhip. Yeah. What do we need bullwhip for? No more questions. No, what do we need blue whip for? Okay, we got miners here. I need explanation. Okay. Oh, he is not going to tell us about the reason why does he have that bullwhip, but okay. 
Alright, and what else? This board? The Royal Wait. Okay. Wait, let me take a look. This is the Royal Wait. The first thing you do when you start your shift is take a look. I see. And oh, wait, what is that? The Royal Wait. If the Castle Guard Corp can achieve a good star rating this month, there will be a pizza party at the barracks. Woo! Pizza party! We can call Domino's, call Pizza Hut, call any pizza restaurant nearby and then have a pizza party. Oh, oh but there is a note. There is a note here. It says that it's strictly one slice limit per guardsman. Okay. And then, from the desk of Councilwoman Ash, there will be a demonstration in the city square this evening held by members of the Mate Guild. If any of the speakers come through your gate, please call my office to initiate their escort and secondary screening. Okay? So there will be, I think, mages. With tall witch hat, yes, magic, broom, cats. Congratulations to Guardsman Randy on 35 years at his post. Congratulations, Randy! Meanwhile, for the Guardsman Shamis, he is about to go 35 meters away from his post and leaving his daughter to mind the post. Thank you. And the next one, after six months undercover operation at the Sprawl Cavern for the elderly, okay, a group of sweet grammys and grampies were discovered to be trafficking illegal drugs into and out of the city. Huh? 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 Wait, so you are telling me? That these senior citizens, they are smuggling drugs. Okay, uh, uh, that's new, that's fresh. Okay, usually, usually I don't want to judge, but usually it would be teenagers or maybe at most early middle adulthood. But senior citizen, okay. Well, not every old person is to be treated as a drug mole. Please be vigilant when dealing with somebody's grandparent, striker. Okay, thank you for the warning. And then the last one, the press joker, six person with funny name. If you call and pick you my interest, there is a cash bonus in it for you, Malcolm. So I have to find someone with funny names, but the question is, do we share the same kind of humor? Because I could be laughing at someone's name and he might not find it funny. And that could happen like the same thing. He will find someone's name funny, but well, I don't see anything funny in that someone's name. Okay, after all, fun is subjective, I would say, unless, unless you share like the same kind level of humor. And yes, it's got a lot of the information we will need to do our job. Basically, reading this, it gives me like a pretty good insight about what I'm going to face today. Okay, there will be people coming in and they have type like what kind of people that is going to come. And I like that. I like that. This royal read is actually really helpful. Thank you. Mm-hmm. Oh, and it won't cost me any action points. That's amazing. Okay, I love this game. Alright, let's, let's go, I guess. And the next, the last one is the grandma. I already told you. Selecting mm -hmm. the person means you interrogate them and hear more of their story. Uh -huh. It's the best way to find out someone's true intentions. Mm -hmm. Sometimes. Sometimes. Okay. Sometimes. Oh, because people lies, right? Human cannot be trusted. The only thing that you can trust is the cat's meowing, okay? Sometimes using a tool will do the job better. Or the mm -hmm. phone, or it's a combination of things. I don't know, you can spend all three action points just interrogating them for all I care. Alright, oh my god, my dad. He's not a teacher and he sucks at one and... Yeah, I don't think there is anything else that I can do. And if you look at our father, he already looks impatient enough. 
this is the face of someone that wants to go gacha to try his luck okay even though it's going to fail yeah use the wicked 3000 to make the big uh -huh. decision to let someone in or send them packing all right now you can choose to use the wicked 3000 at any point during a turn but sometimes it's better to use up all three action points to find out everything you can by any means necessary okay got it I I i'll do my best sometimes Okay, please stop using sometimes, okay? Because whenever he, this guy says sometimes, it feels like there's this Britney Spears song playing. Sometimes I want sometimes. Yeah, yeah I think I think and I, think I mistake really the lyrics, like I but right now, it's so just pick around a damn that line. Mm hmm All right, yeah, I'll, I'll just I'll just let Grandma in, okay? She seems well trusty enough. Oh, but. But, but, she has... Did you guys read the royal writ that I just read before? It says that some grandma and some grandpa will be bringing drugs with them. And... And she gave me a cake. Okay, she gave me a cake. And, of course, there's always a possibility that the cake is dosed with drugs. Okay? Just one bite and I will go flying. It could be... So, um, well, it's a tutorial, right? There is no way they're going to make me fail at the tutorial. If I fail at the tutorial, I'm changing the channel's name to fail at tutorial for one day. But no, I trust in my decision. Let's let Mrs. Abernathy in. Mm hmm You are in, ma'am. Come in. Yes, thank you for the cake. That bribery works. Great works job, wonder. Leo. Your mother would be so proud to see mm -hmm. you now. After my delivery, I'm off to watch the big game. Okay, good day, Mrs. Abernathy. I hope you're happy. Got my grandson's inheritance mm -hmm. riding on a tip that the Stapleford <laughs> Snowhorns are gonna win it today. Oh gosh, well, well, in a way, if you don't have enough inheritance to give to your children or your grandchildren, betting in a horse riding in a horse race could help raise the fun for the inheritance, yes? Here's a tip. Oh my Never god, it's Mrs. dark Abernathy joke, money to bet but I love it, yes. What is it? Lend Mrs. Abernathy money to bet with, okay. Got it. Okay, so that means they both has bad luck with gachaing, with gambling, yes. Let's hurry along to the game. We don't want to be late, do we, Hamish? Oh, wait. She says her name's right. Right? Hamish. She's so excited that she said her name right. Okay? Did you hear that, Dad? She calls you Hamish, okay? My name is Shamish. No, wait. <laughs> it's not. Oh. <laughs> I better go. No. Time to put on your big kid pants. You can do this. No, no, no. And he's just like, oh my god, he's so ungrateful, okay? I mean, Mrs. Abernathy finally calls him Hamish, and he's just like, my name is Seamus. No, no, wait, wait. It's not, okay? But yes, good day to you, Mrs. Abernathy, and well, to you, Dad, yes. More like I'm being forced to do this. Yes, we could go to school. We could, like, study. We could, like, learn the world with our eyes. Instead, we are forced to sit here looking outside the window, even though that window doesn't have any glass. Anything to protect me if someone decided to throw rocks at me. It's only for today, mm -hmm. I swear. Come meet me in the tavern when the shift is over. Good luck. Uh, I, I hope so, Dad. I Good luck hope with your so. illegal gambling. <laughs> I, love I love the dialogue. Whoever makes the dialogue for this game, you deserve a raise. Okay, you did a pretty good job with the dialogue. I love it. Yes. I don't need luck. Good luck with your illegal gambling. Oh my god, so cocky, Dad. Everyone needs luck, okay? Everyone needs luck. The people who plays gacha game needs luck, okay? Like me, I need luck. Yes? Believe me, he does. Believe me, you do need luck, ma'am. You both have bad luck. 
You make other people richer because of your bad luck, ma'am. Yeah, thank you. Thank you. We all need luck. Okay, the okay, more well, of the story, you got this. the summary, we all need luck. And yes, okay, really, you got this. We got this. Viewer Tom, we got this. Let's go. Nervous. If you want to ask for my opinion, I'm nervous. Really, really nervous. Goodbye, Mrs. Abernathy. Alright, yes, I read this already and I'm not going to read this again. Okay, I can always come back to it later as well. So, yeah, there is no need to actually read that. Charmed okay. to make your acquaintance, young Gateminder. Mm. I am Tyronius Athanatos, son of Brielle and Darunia Athanatos. Okay, and from what franchise of Lord of the Ring you came from, sir? Is he a dark elf? I think he is a dark elf. And honestly, there is this saying, do not judge a book by its appearance. But they never say to do not judge an elf by its appearance. So I'm going to judge him. First of all, we're going to judge him from his school one. One school, school one, I don't care. It's either school like that bone school or school where children goes to study. Both are scary, so hmm, suspicious. I have been All summoned right. to deliver the keynote speech at the Festival of Magical mm -hmm. Freedom tonight, hosted by the Majors Guild. Okay. Will you require anything further? Wait. Okay, calm down, sir. I remember in the Royal Rift, okay, in here, it says that if there is a member of the Mage Guild, I have to call Ash. Ash, ma'am. So that's what I will do, okay? Call Ash. Ring, ring. Hello, ma'am. I'm so glad you called. Mm -hmm. Frankly, I was worried you guardsmen never followed the writ due to illiteracy. I'm not a guardsman. Yes, I'm just a kid. And we have one dark elf here, okay, and he looks suspicious. No, actually he looks kind. He looks like a good person, but it is his school. That is suspicious, ma'am. What should I do? Equip the mage and my people will escort him to the venue. Ooh, okay. That's all? That's all you got to say for me, ma'am? And then what should I do next? Maybe, hmm, talk to him? Yeah, What's your speech about? Oh, my dear child. Mm -hmm. It is obvious to me that you do not possess a magical bone in your <gasps> body. And my speech, therefore, would only serve to confuse and frighten you. Did you just look down on me? I can offer the cadavra you, ma'am. Not ma'am, you, sir. I can offer the cadavra you back to what forest that you belong to, sir. Watch your tone, watch your words, okay? Wait, actually, does Vampire and Elf ever get along? Do they ever, like, exist in the same franchise together? I want to know if Vampire gets along with Elf, okay? Is my kin gets along with his kin? But yeah, I don't trust you, okay? You look down on me. I doubt me. that. I think I could figure it out. Mm-hmm. I'm not dumb, sir. Well, well sometimes. But, but... Well, most of the time, but I'm, I can understand what my father wants to say. Many non-magical beings have attempted to learn mm -hmm. the arts, and many of those have gone mad trying to even comprehend them. Be warned. Um, you know what? He sounds like one of the scammer, the online scammer that you see everywhere on the internet. He sounds like one of those guys, and hmm. I don't think he's going to let us talk though. He's he's very defensive. He just keeps saying like using fruity, sophisticated words because he thought that as a child we cannot understand what he says, so wait wait, we have truth serum. Right? I don't want to use it so early in the game actually because I feel like this is like the most precious things, the most precious tools to have. But yeah, maybe let's just use it on him, throat spray. Okay. Smell that, yes? To 
tonight I will inspire my fellow mages to throw off the shackles of oppression forced huh? upon them by huh? the weak huh? and frightened smaggle powers that be. Huh? 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 Sir? Sir? Calm down. Calm down. Why are you planning a rebellion so early in the game? Okay, this is episode 1. Okay, not episode 101. No. 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 Excuse me. Tonight, we will demand the freedom oh to gosh. flex our might. Freedom to control our destiny. Freedom to unleash our powers. Uh, uh, uh okay. I guess my hunch with the school is right. No, I'm not letting you through. Okay, freedom. No, no freedom. Get out. Huh? Get out from my town. Okay, get out. After that whole dark speech, that whole feeling monologue, if we still let him in, okay, if we still let him in, you should uninstall the game, okay? No, we're not letting him in. We are not letting him in. No, no. You are a bad, bad guy. Go back. Go back to the forest, okay? You have no right to deny me. No right to even stand mm -hmm, in my mm -hmm. view, you pathetic okay. smaggle. Okay, is this like their way of saying muggles? Because in Harry Potter, yes, if you are a human, they will call you muggles. And I think right now this game is parodying it and saying it as smaggle. Okay, I may be a smaggle, sir, but I can smack your ass out of the gate. Out, out, out. What's that? Yeah, yeah, you don't need to know. You don't need to know. Okay, you don't need to know. You are not of eight yet. Yes, that is the word mm -hmm. we mages use to describe worthless, magicless yes, beings. Yes, I such can as you. smack you out. Thank you. You're Goodbye, a prime sir. grade A example mm -hmm. of a smaggle. Yes, and I will smack you as well. Let's go. Dude, that's pretty weak. Yes. No, it is not weak. It cuts to the core. No, no, no. No, I'm that's so lame. Sorry. Get out of here. Yes, get out of here. I like how badass she is, okay? She's not afraid. She's not afraid even though like he has one school, school one, yes, on his hip. She's just like, nah, that's lame. Get out of here. I love her badass self, okay? Ooh, okay, we got four star for that. You use the truth spray and learn the full extent of his nefarious plan. And you call the council woman, but you could not in good conscience let this dude in. Both of guardsmen, it's guardswoman, okay? Alright, please appreciate woman more. I'm playing as a... Whoa! Good afternoon! I am here to pick up my two kids from the no-good, stingy, low-life of a father who happens to be my lying, cheating, low-life of an ex-husband, Orlando. Oh, that's so sad to hear, ma'am. You know what? You know what, ma'am? Uh, actually, you don't have to pick up your kids. You just have to smack down your ex-husband, okay? If he did those things to you. I'm so sorry for you, ma'am. His address okay. is there on this incomprehensible, illegible letter my kids sent me. Okay. Mm -hmm. what, what, what is that? I would love to have him get off his sorry butt and bring them to me for once. <laughs> okay. Okay, so we got a letter. Wait, can I talk to it her? It was his week with them. No, mm -hmm. I'm sorry. It was his and his new girlfriend oh. Kelly's week with them. So, your ex-husband is living with his new girlfriend right now? Ooh, that, that sounds like a lot of celebrities problem nowadays, yes? And you want to know what the kids say about her? They say she's fun. <laughs> they say she's fun. I'm sure the letter they wrote is all about her. Can't decode it to save my life, though. My kids' writing is so lousy. Ah, decode? Well, we have the tools for that. Wait. 
Um, you know what? I want to tease her. Actually, I honestly, like from the deep of myself, I want to tease her. But first of all, first lesson in socializing is that you have to look at her, okay? One wrong words and I'm going to get pummeled to the ground. I'm going to become one with this wood floor that I have in my station right now. So... No, my survival instinct kicks in, so maybe I will just trust you, yeah? That letter was pretty mm -hmm. much illegible. Yes? See what I mean? Mm -hmm. Horrible, horrible penmanship. Yeah, and whose children is that, ma'am? I think it's not mine. Yes? Wait, do we have that letter? Because I want to decode that with the ring. <laughs> and you know the funniest thing about it is that when you think about it, this ring looks like a really, really sophisticated ring. It's made from gold and there is this, well, carving surrounding it. And then you just use it to decode a children's writing, yes. What a waste of a tool. But yeah, let me just use that, I think. Scanning. Mm-hmm. Okay, can I take a look at that? Yes. What happened with that? I don't know how to tell you this, but there's mm -hmm. more of this letter than meets the eye. There's a hidden message written here. Ooh, okay. It says, Come, son, mommy. Kelly is night more. <gasps> Does that make sense to you? Oh, no. That sounds like a cry for help, ma'am. You got to trigger your super mother senses and now run to your ex-husband house and break it down in the process could be nice as well. Oh my god! Yes? My boys don't know how to spell! <laughs> but also that thing about Kelly being the worst! Oh my god, that's the first thing that you just realize. Like that's the first thing that she actually cares about. My boy doesn't know how to spell, doesn't know how to write. Okay, but yes, um, I think everything is dangerous right now. Everything is quite dire for her. Yes, run along ma'am, run along the street. Okay. I knew oh, I oh, never oh, should oh, have oh, introduced oh. them to each other. Kelly was my hairdresser. I'm so sorry ma'am, I double click on that, but Oh, apparently she has more dialogue to share. All right, let's listen to her. Mm-hmm. Was is the key word. Mm -hmm. Can I go get my kids now? Yes, yes. All right, yeah, I trust you. And oh my god, <laughs> Kelly is your hairdresser? Oh, I pity People her. People come and go. But no matter what, you'll always be those kids' mother. Yes. Oh my god, Leo, you say the wisest words. You're right. I will be, no matter who that low-life jerk uh -huh, ex-husband uh -huh. Orlando dates. Yes, smack him down, ma'am. Smack him down. Thank you for saying that. Oh, that is so wholesome. Okay, all right. We got all that. All right. And I, of course, of course, I will let her in. Okay? Go along, super mom. Super mom, go along. All right. All right. I think that's all. Thanks. Mm -hmm. Don't worry, Palafamas Orlando Jr. Mama's coming for ya. <laughs> oh no, one of them is named Orlando Jr. Oh no, one of them is named after their father. Oh, you have a bad luck there, Orlando Jr. Good luck. Mm, good luck. <sighs> okay. Ooh! Okay, I did a good job. Good use of the decoder ring, guardsman. You did not judge a book by its cover. And you knew not to stand in the way of a mama bear and her cups. Yes. And her name is Denise the Cyclops. Oh, yeah. Yeah, she is a Cyclops. Okay. And of course, we will not stand in front of her way. Okay. My survival instinct is still working just fine and i still want to live to see another day in little guardsman yes oh gosh all right let's what continue bloody blazing blasted hell is the hold up why have we stopped help why what in the world such colorful words that you have grandpa 
Well, sir, okay. the guard. Mm-hmm. Silence! Speak when spoken to, or you'll oh, get no? the whip. Whelp. Hey, you are not the only one with whip. I have whip as well. Okay. Yes, sir. Oh no, are you okay, well? I'm so sorry, did you get abused by this old man? This old man with long nose that looks like a Pinocchio, but second grade? Now, you mm -hmm. child, let me pass. I have important business to attend to. Mm -hmm. Come on, shake a leg. BS mm -hmm. waits for no man. Wait, what is BS? BS? Yeah, yeah, what is, what is BS? Bank of the Sprawl. Wait, bang of the sprawl, okay. Well, that's unfortunate. Well, that's unfortunate. Okay. He's suspicious, okay? The way he talks, the way he behaves, the way he treats. You whelp! Oh my god, I'm so sad. Can you just run from him? No? He got you with his leash? I'm so sorry, whelp. And yes, I'm... Honestly, honestly, I'm curious about that big box that they have. Can I, like, x-ray them using this? Yeah, I want to see. Mm-hmm. Scanning, okay. Oh my gosh, I can see your TBC. I can see your heart. I can see your disease. Whoa, Whoa. that's a lot of cheddar. This is not a cheddar. No, this is a gold, Leo. No, ma'am. It is gold. Yes! This is the source of human greed, Lil. Look and learn. Observe and learn. Okay? Silence! <gasps> yes, it is gold, but it is legitimate. Certainly not blood gold, if that's what you were thinking. Okay, can I, can I slap him back? Silence! Yes, now that you mention it, is this a blood gold? You are the one who says it yourself. Sir? Well, I wasn't before you said anything. True, that's suspicious. Oh, oh, we can confiscate that. We can confiscate the gold? Hmm. Hmm. Did you smell that, guys? Did you smell that? That's the smell of... My first step in becoming billionaire in this game. Confiscate, yes. I think I'll have to take a sample of this for, you know, science. Yes, for, you know, science. Mm -hmm. Why, you greedy little urchin. I think I like you more than ever. Oh, 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 you actually like that, sir? Oh, you have a wacky sense of humor and interest. Okay. Ooh. Now, since we you get are finished cake, rifling through we my gold. personal belongings, you insufferable petty little monster, uh -huh. let me pass. Wait, 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 wait. Um. I wonder what the stamp on these gold bars means. Maybe it's decodable. Oh no, but I already used my decode ring. Yes, my Lord of the Ring ring. I have already used that on the children's writing so I guess I can't use that now because it runs out of battery we only get one time charge so um maybe talk yeah can I talk what to you? What kind of business do you have at the bank today mm -hmm. sir? I shan't be hearing the details of my BS appointment mm -hmm. with some nosy little brat tending the gate. Mind your business or you'll get the whip, child. Ha, 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 ha. Do not threaten me with a whip, okay? I got whip myself. And if you want our relationship to turn soon into a whipping relationship, I can and I will definitely up for that, okay? Yes, he shouldn't threaten to whip people. Actually, that reminds Lil of her toolkit, yes. And no, I dop you because you I are being very defensive. I don't think you're allowed to not tell me what your mm -hmm. business is. Yes. Insolence! Ha! Huh. But sir, it's only a deposit. One no. more outburst and it will be back in the cage with you. Oh no. 
No, no, no. This guy is too far. This guy is too far. Can I use the whip? I don't know what I should do with this whip, but I want to use it on him. Ooh! Okay. Uh, I'm sorry, sir. I was just slouching only for a second. I'll make sure that none of the blood gold falls out of its case. Ah, that's the blood gold. Mm-hmm. You nincompoop. It wasn't me using the whip. If it was, believe me, you'd feel it. Okay, okay. Secret and tea spilled. Okay, my cup of tea is full. My pocket too is soon going to be full. I see. Wait a second. Did he say blood gold? Uh -huh. Isn't that illegal? It is. He didn't say blood gold, he said bloody gold. It's a form of slang he must have picked up from somewhere. Isn't that right, you bloody idiot? Ah, uh, isn't that right, you bloody grandpa? Yes? It's a good thing that I don't dabble with blood. Okay, you can see it in the about section of my channel. You should be glad, sir, because that means no biting involved today. And yes? Yes, sir. W whatever you say, sir. Of course, with that kind of information, I can't let him through, okay? And I don't think I will ever want to let him through. So yes, deny. Deny access for him. Yes. Sorry, sir. Let's try another day, another time. Or it's not, you are bad. fault, isn't it? Nasty, deceptive. Oh, 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 now you are, oh my god, you are displacing, yes, displacing your anger at someone else. No! What about this? Let me through the mm -hmm. gate, but I shall leave the goblin tied up nope, outside nope, like nope. the cur he is. Mm -hmm, nope, nope, nope. But sir, the gold! Science? No, don't All slap right, you rotten him! Little girl, I'll go. I'm worried but about you rue him. the day you crossed me. I have the whip, sir. Don't you worry, too. I got whip and I got tons of weapon behind me. Actually, I just realized that behind me, if you look at this uh, crate above my head, I get like several weapon ready to use against him. Yes. All right. Goodbye, sir. Nope, you are not getting it. Yes. You foiled a blood gold trafficker on your first damn day, legend! Mm-hmm. Oh my god, I did not expect that. Actually, I just want to get back at him. I just want to smack him myself. Whip him, actually. Whip him myself. Okay, the phone is ringing. Okay. 911, what is your emergency? Good afternoon. This is Dr. Marquess, Beatrix von Matterhorn mm -hmm. calling. Who may I ask am I speaking to? Oh, that's a long name. Sorry, ma'am. We do not have any name-changing service. This is Lil. Yes, this is Lil and Riri. Yes. Nice to meet you, Lil. I need one of you gate guards to come down to the dig site as soon as you can. Ah, uh, okay. All right. Okay, and where exactly is... Uh, okay. She hung up. Yeah, I don't know why. I mean, she got long name, but her dialogue is so short. I think all her dialogue goes to her name. Sorry, Lil. Mm-hmm. <sighs> honestly, honestly, playing this game trigger my roasting side a lot. Well, I feel like I have been I have roasting come to the a lot to participate of participate in capitalism. Mm-hmm. After years on the road as a traveling merchant, I'm finally ready to put down roots. And what better place than the sprawling metropolis of the sprawl? Okay. You know what he reminds me of since we got that talk about Harry Potter? He actually reminds me of Harry Potter's uncle, the Dudley Dudley family. I don't know how to pronounce their name, but he looks... Oh my god, he just reminds me of that family, of the father, or, or maybe the, the son the son himself, yes? Huh, mm -hmm. I just got that. Garby Bunches is the name. Garby Bunches. Okay. Garby Bunches? <laughs> Funny name. But that's gotta be made up. I'm gonna have to see some documentation. Wait, is that a funny name? I don't think it's a funny name. I don't see anything funny with that. Okay. Can't fault you for doing your due diligence. 
Here's my vendor's license issued by the Sprawl Board of Trade. Yes? A vendor license. Ooh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I actually read in the review. And yes, in the review mostly, that they say that this game has similar mechanic with Paper Please. Yes, did I already mention that? And this, uh, I haven't played Paper Please at all, but I have watched my friends, like, uh, she streams it to us, to me and my other friends, one time. And I do remember that they have this document screening process as well. So let me take a look, okay? The same, uh, what does you say this kind of nose? This nose is very similar. Flintstone, yeah, the Flintstone nose, okay? Ears look the same, two TB dots as well, smock smirk check, and then, oh my god, hair check, yes, vibe check. Yeah, I think, I think he's honest enough. Yeah, I'll, I'll just right. return it Everything to is him. in order. Mm-hmm. Okay, and... Oh yeah, he got funny names, right? You got funny names. Let me call... Malcolm. Mm-hmm. Because I remember... Garby yes? Why have I heard that name before? Wait mm -hmm. a minute. Ask him if he's descended from Garbanzo the Terrible. Garbanzo the Terrible. And yes, the reason why I called Malcolm, if you remember from that royal writ, it says that if we see any funny names, we go to report it to Malcolm. And he finds it interesting enough, we will get cash. And right now, our cash just goes up from 0 to 10. So I think he is interested. Are you related to Garbanzo the Terrible? Yeah, Garbanzo the Terrible? Yep, my great 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 grandpappy Garbanzo. Great 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 grandpappy Garbanzo. Okay. OMG, tell him I'm a huge <laughs> fan. I've got so many questions. Like, why did he use an ice cream scoop? How did he dispose of all that mess? Wait, using ice cream scoop is supposed to make sure that there is no mess when eating ice cream, right? And don't you have like any other important things to ask to your idols, to someone that you are a fan of? Malcolm? Oh my god. This isn't helpful. Yes, this isn't helpful. Goodbye, Malcolm. You're not helpful. You're not funny, Malcolm. Shut up, okay? At least I'm helpful doing my job here instead of you making jokes on people's name. My joke's funnier, Malcolm. Thank you. Oh my god, I have to assert my dominance against the royal jester in this game. Alright, so I don't know what I should do. I don't think... Wait, the rest of the items that I have is just metal detector and honestly, honestly, he is a merchant. If he claims to be a merchant, there must be a gold inside that suitcase. So using metal de detector, I don't think will work wonders. Let's just stop. Let's just stop with him. I just can't wait him. to get in the mix and figure uh -huh. out what kind of merchant this place really needs. Okay. Since I was a boy selling lemonade, when life literally gave me lemons, I've dreamed of maximizing profits and keeping overhead low. <laughs> when life literally gave me lemons, yes. Well, I see, okay. I've always said this place needs a nondescript vendor to shake things up a little. See, you get it. Once I've set up shops selling, well, whatever I decide to sell, I'll be uh -huh. sure to give you a discount. Wait, what do you want to sell, sir? I think we need to establish I look forward to that buying first. Uh, something. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, since we don't even know what we want to buy from him. Yeah, I know. I know, I know. Oh, I'm see, not planning see to sell the lemonade, double click. But I see? could see a stall for, well, capes and monocles. Really tap into the opera and or vampire market. Ooh, ooh, vampire market. Wait. 
What do you want to sell? Do you want to sell vampire on a vampire market, or do you want to sell things for vampire on the vampire market? Because if you are selling vampire, it's called vampire trafficking, okay? And we do not condone any trafficking. How about right? powders and ointments? Who doesn't love a good ointment? Um. There's nothing more exciting than the chance of unlimited possibility. <laughs> I love, I love her voice actor. Okay, I love her voice. You're really making me feel good about this, kid. When I start expanding, uh -huh. I'll let you in on the ground floor. We need discounts, uh, we need free things, actually, free, okay? Like that guy from uh, uh, Atanatos family, freedom, yeah, we don't want the dumb, we just want the free, thank you. You can take you can the dumb, the I will keep the free. Uh -huh. Alright, well, I think, I think he's a real marketing guy, true and true. Okay, he's dressed like one, he's act like one, he talks like one, so... Yeah, let's just admit him. Yeah, let's just admit him. There is no problem with his form as well, I think. So yeah, please, please let you be a good Can guy. Can you smell that? <laughs> mm-hmm, yes. The smell of money, right? The smell of gold bar in my inventory? No, you cannot take that. That's mine. The trash barge? Yeah, it comes through <laughs> no. on the weekends. The smell only lingers for a couple of mm -hmm. days. Not the reek of filth and decay. That's the reek of opportunity. See you around. <laughs> you should have said it with a more convincing way, sir. Not the reek of filth and decay. That is the reek of opportunity. See you around. You should have said it like that, okay? Be a little more optimistic, okay? You are the one who is a salesman, not me. You are the one who is a merchant, not me, okay? All right, I think we are done for the day. And oh my god, we did a pretty good job on our first day, okay? All of them got three stars. We would have known that a funny name would lead to connecting Jester Malcolm to one of his historical heroes. Good job, yes. We have money for that, so I'm happy. W what is that sound? Yes? No more folks, time to close up shop. Ah, so when the window closed, that means we are done. Okay. Yeah! <laughs> Due you to your exceptional job performance. Oh my god, the way they I would say like count the score count the score sounds like a college GPA, okay? You were paid 30 gold for this shift. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you everyone, viewers at home for making this possible for me. No, I'm the one who makes this possible myself. Sorry, guys. Alright. And, yeah. Let me take a look. Yeah, I see. So we can, like, take a good look at every client that we encounter in this level. I see. Alright, let's continue. And I wonder if... I can like meet Garby Bunches again, okay? I'm curious like what will happen if I meet like Garby Bunches again, okay? Wait, what is this place? Is this like the town map? Yeah, this is the town map. Okay, wait. Um, we have to go to the dig site, right? And I can't go anywhere else. I was actually looking for the save button because I don't want to lose my progress. But I think it's auto save. I think. Alright. What place is this? Oh, you are the ma'am with long names. Hello, ma'am. Uh, can I talk to her? Should I talk to her? Ma'am? Yeah, I want to talk to you. Oh my, were you left behind? The last group of school children departed hours ago. Ah! Feel free to wait in the lost and found box until someone comes to collect you. And 
yes, oh my, were you left behind? The last group of school children departed hours ago. Feel free to wait in the lost and found box until someone comes to collect you. No, we're not school children, okay? We are way past that. We speedrun our education and now we are working, okay? We are working as a guard, okay? No, you called me. I'm uh -huh. Will. We spoke on the phone. I was covering for my dad at the South Gate. Yes. Uh, of course, Lil. Yes. Uh -huh. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> but no, this is highly irregular. But then again, you'll have to do for the sake of time. <laughs> sake of time. <laughs> do you get it? I don't. I don't get it. Okay, the only humor that I get is from Lil. Okay, I don't get the jokes of any other people in this town. Even the royal jester, okay? No. Yes, no. Trust me, you will. <laughs> no, no. I don't understand as well, ma'am. Okay, who are you? Who are you again? Uh -huh. Dr. Marquess Beatrix von Matterhorn, head of archaeological research at the Royal uh -huh. Academy. Marquess Beatrix von Matterhorn. Marquess Beatrix von Matterhorn. Marquess Beatrix von Matterhorn. Okay. But you can call me B. Uh, okay. Long name, short, short nickname. Yes, long name, short nickname. Gotcha. And what's so great about Bad this place? Bad fun matter and horn. I think I missed some words. I think I'm missing one word. Okay, I already forgot her name. Yes, B. <laughs> okay. Would you like a long or short version? Short. Short and it's sweet. It's a hole in the like ground me. where we get power crystals from. <laughs> this, this is the only time that I'm going to admit that I'm short is when you pair it with the word sweet, yes. Short and sweet, like moi, yours truly, yes. Okay, power no, crystal. Sweet. Mm-hmm. Tell me more. The power crystal was discovered completely by accident. Ooh. 80 years ago, on this site, an iconic dwarven heavy metal band performed to celebrate the coronation of Princess Desdemona's grandfather, King Artemis. Wow, okay, that's a long history. At the moment of a particularly uh -huh. rumpus drum solo, the vibrations opened up a chasm swallowing the entire stage and the musicians and a few dozen enthusiastic fans. Wait, isn't that a tragedy? That's a Legend tragedy. says the band emerged from the chasm adorned in the glowing magical rocks, or what oh, we know as power crystals today. Okay, and and look at Lil's face. Okay, she's speechless. She's like, wow, that is the best rock concert in the century. <laughs> that must have looked awesome. That must have looked awesome and awfully scary the first time you see it mm -hmm. very awesome but there's more whether by fate or the actions of an inebriated mage the bass player was struck by a lightning bolt huh? and the crystals in her cape and beard absorbed the electric discharge wait 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 is the bass player safe is she alive is she not hurt from being struck by a lightning bolt Everything that previously relied uh -huh. on magic within a five-mile radius lit up and was charged for weeks. Ah, uh, so that's where the crystal comes from. Hardcore! Hardcore! Oh my god, she's Very so hardcore. Lovely. A massive industry sprung up and developed the multitudes of uh -huh. ways we use power crystals, which ushered in an unprecedented era of prosperity for the sprawl, making uh -huh. our city-state the world power it is today. I see, okay. Gotcha. But what does this have to do with me? I am the preeminent expert in the advanced properties of power crystals, and my research suggests we have barely scratched the surface of what these puppies can do. Okay, crystals, research, archaeology, is there a mummy involved? Because if it's yes, I'm eating myself out of here. We do not play with mummy. Okay, but again, what does this have to do with me? Yeah, 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 I still don't understand. Is this the place where we come from to buy crystals to charge our tools? Lil, I have found how to harness the crystal's power to alter the very fabric of time. May huh? I present 
The Chronometer 3000. Chronometer 3000? The one that we have is called... Wait, what's the again? Wicca 3000. And now we have Chronometer 3000. What is it about you and 3000? I love you, 3000. Hmm? And what I need to know from you is... Do you know anyone who would be willing to go on what some might call an adventure? Oh, you don't have to look so far. She's here herself. She will accept your offer now. Okay. Um, I want to push the button. I want to push the button. Can I push the button? Is it alright for me to push the button? Guys, viewer at home. Mama, Mike, let's push the button. Okay. Learn by doing. Oh, oh, oh. Is, is there a game over in this game? C can I have a gr uh, game over because I accidentally press... Not accidentally, like I Wait, what? actually Where press... am I? What just yes. happened? Yes? No, no, no. I mean... Okay, at least we do not get game over, but I'm really, really curious like whether or not this game has game over feature or not. Okay. Oh, oh, the phone is ringing, okay. Um, alright. Pick up the phone, yes, just pick up the phone. Good afternoon, this is Dr. Marquess Beatrix Von Matterhorn calling. Who may I ask, am I speaking to? Deja vu. Deja vu. Check this out. You were about to tell me you need a gate guard to come down to the dig site, right? Yes. Okay. My word, you gate guards are intuitive. I hope they're paying you a more than fair wage. I hope so too. Okay, I need money. So that my father doesn't go gambling and letting me replacing his job as a guard. But yes, I, why do we need to go back in time though? Please don't tell me that I have to redo things again. But if we start from this point in time, I think we only have to meet one client. They probably aren't. The way my dad complains about it. Yes, I know. She hung up. Again. <laughs> again. Alright. Why, hello there. I've come to the sprawl to participate in capitalism. After years on the road as a- Wait. Let me stop you there. Your name is Grabby Blanchers, right? You're a traveling merchant or something? No, no, wait, wait. I'm confused. So every level, yes, we can like replay, we can like go back in time and redo our mistake. Is that what it does? I don't understand. Oh, I see my reputation precedes me. Mm -hmm. Kind of. The name is Garby Bunches. Please do not repeat that dialogue, okay? This is so weird. I swear I already dealt with this guy. I can either do the same thing as I did last time, or, or maybe this is a chance to try something different. Mm, is that a flag? Is that a flag of you, developer, telling me to do something different today? Hmm. I'm sorry. Are you talking to me? No, I'm sorry. We're just discussing things between ourselves, okay? That's what I'm trying to decide, Garbs. <laughs> All right. Regardless, here's my vendor license issued by the Sprawl Board of Trade for confirmation. Hmm. Well, the last time I returned his document to him. Is it alright if I confiscate him? What will happen if I confiscate these documents? I want to know. Okay. Let oh, me... I think I might need that. I think I'm gonna need it more. <laughs> okay. Wait, did I just make a mistake? I thought that I will just try to do something different and confiscate it. Is it okay for me to confiscate that document? Okay, if you say so. <laughs> I need to get this guy processed and get my butt uh -huh. back to the dig site. Yes, yes. And okay, he's just very chill. He's like, okay, 
you take my paper? It's okay. We can always forge another one. Yes, but he is a good guy. So let's just admit him. Yes. All right. Come along. Open your shop. Okay. I swear I've done this already. I remember pulling <gasps> the lever. Yes. Can you smell that? The smell of opportunity. I think then you said something about opportunity. Mm-hmm. You got it. See you around. See you around. Wish you luck with the shop. Even though I confiscated your documents. All right. Let's go back. I need back. to get back I to think, the dig yes. site to figure out what just happened. Yes, let's go back to Mr. Mrs. Beatrix von Mackerhorn. Mackerhorn. I forgot. Mrs. Bia. Yes, Bia. B. 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 Yes, B. All right. Let's go back to the dig site. Let's visit her. Mm hmm. Welcome! Wait, can I take a look at a lot of things in this place? Machines like this are a relatively new discovery in the sprawl. Lil noticed the words Commander Keen among the inscrutable technical jargon, okay? You know, she has all of these machines, but at the same time, she has all of these mythical creatures scattered around as well. So, what are you, B? Yes, ammonia, hydrogen, iodine, all pretty basic stuff. I don't think it's basic stuff. Actually, wait, can I go to the back? No. The hole is so deep, you can't see the bottom. They must have a really good ladder guy. I want to check the tent. I can't. Alright. Okay, let's just talk to her then. Oh, Lil, from the phone call earlier, uh -huh. of course. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, but no, this is highly irregular. But then again, you'll have to do for the sake of time. Huh, sake of time. Do you get it? Don't get it. I already told you no. <laughs> oh, wait, I actually do. My name is Dr. Marquess Beatrix oh, yeah, von Matterhorn, Marquess. head of yes. archaeological... Marquis Logical Fine research at the Royal Day School for Smart People. You said I can call you Trixie. We've been through this before. I'd prefer if you called me B. <laughs> yes, B. Yes, B. And B, this my is the site where power crystals were first discovered and you used them to make a time machine. True, true. Then you baited me with promises of adventure and pretty much forced me to push the big shiny button on your silly little time machine and now I'm pretty sure I'm just traveled back through time and I'm kind of freaking okay. out here. Mm -hmm. Any questions? I love her voice actor, okay? Uh, it's amazing, alright? And yeah, let's ask Wait, about time travel. Wait, why am I asking you questions? For any of this to be possible, it would require <laughs> the use of my newly crafted device. May I present the Chronometer 3000? Yes, we have been through this before. Wait, where did it go? Well, it's on Lil, I think. Do you mean this? See? Mm hmm. My invention! How did you get that? Yeah, how did you get that? You gave it to me. Well, not really, but you were gonna give it to me, I think. You were in the <laughs> middle of explaining. And you were seduced by the glowing red button. E. Guilty as charged, ma'am. Guilty as charged. I mean, not only Lil got seduced, me, me, me got seduced as well. Sorry. Can you blame me? <laughs> Can you blame us? Yes, I'm so sorry. Yes, but it is a good button. I'm just proud of myself that your particles weren't immediately dispersed to the furthest reaches of space and time. Oh, so that could cost us a game over. Okay. That risk becomes much lower once I configure it to your individual life source, which I will do now. Or actually, it's not game over. It's actually life's over. Good thing, good thing it doesn't happen. No accidents happening. Alright, configure. Thank you. You are At a kind, rate, nice lady. I think the castle gate is a perfect place to test my prototype. And I need a willing gate guard to use the device. 
All right, but I already used that. And allow me to track their progress to make sure only the right people are permitted entry to the sprawl. Do you have any questions? Ah, uh, do I have any questions? Wait, right people? Right people. Uh huh. Individuals or groups that would improve the daily life of the inhabitants of the sprawl, ah. rather than those who would see harm come to the community and castle. I see, I see, yes. Isn't that subjective? Yes, well, I suppose it is, but recently the kingdom has seen a rise in rebellious factions, envious neighboring <laughs> nations, not to mention the resentful mages guild since the power crystal has replaced most household magical applications. No, wait, resentful mages guild, so does that mean that every member from the mages guild is going to be a feeling, is going to be a dangerous person to be admitted in? But. Ash, yes, our lady Mam Ash. She has like this kind of dealings with them. She works with them, I think. So is she a bad person as well? I don't understand. One wrong choice could trigger mm -hmm. a domino effect that could lead to the fall of the sprawl. I see, I get what you mean. Yes, I get it. I get it. But yeah, why don't you use it? Why don't you use it yourself? So to recap, you're giving me, a 12-year-old mm -hmm. who worked exactly one day at the castle gate, the power to rewind time? Why not just use it yourself? True, true. I mean, we get so many things to do on our hands, okay? And you, I see, just has two books on your hand. I think one time travel machine called Chrono 3000 could fit in your hand, ma'am. I have been testing the device myself for months. In fact, I used it to repeat a month's worth of the same day <laughs> oh. and learn to play the oboe. Can I show you? So that's what you do with that device. <laughs> for the love of all that is holy, no, oh, no. Well, perhaps another time. <laughs> she looks so disappointed when I say that. Actually, she honestly, genuinely looked disappointed. My calculations suggest that no mm -hmm. changes I could make from my post at the Royal Academy would have nearly the impact on the sprawl that you gate guards do. Ah, I see. Academia, am I right? <laughs> so I came to the conclusion that trying it out at the gate is a calculated risk worth taking. Okay, valid, valid. It's, she's speaking facts, actually. I think I get the idea, Dr. Mm -hmm. Bean. I'm ready to go out in the world and use this device properly. And definitely not to win the lottery or to repeatedly watch people trip and fall over and over again. Win the lottery, yes! Pave our way to billionaire. And oh yeah, we also got the gold bar in our inventory. You'd want that? <laughs> yes, lottery, With all lottery. That money, I could pay people to trip and fall over and over again. <laughs> Not Regardless, like that. You'll find you can't use it whenever or wherever you want. It is now calibrated, so it will only allow you to fold space and time when you are inside the guard shed. Ah, uh, I see. Okay, I understand. Ah, rats. <laughs> ah, rats. Furthermore, by default, the device will automatically allow you to travel back to the start of your guard shift, including your loadout. Oh, I see. So if we kind of like make a mistake at the start and then we just realize it nearing the end like we made a mistake on the first people and then we just realize it when we are on our fifth people of the day we can rewind time i think reverse time and then start redoing the shift again with maybe a different tools to use a different steps to take i see however i uh -huh. hacked it a bit so that you can jump back to a specific point in the turn hack is the key word though Hack, okay. I have to leave now. There is more science to be done. I will summon you soon, and we will see what else you might be ready for. Thank you, Lil. The world thanks you. You you are the only one thanking me, ma'am. Are you the world no itself? No pressure. Yeah. You can do this. Mm -hmm. Just try not to break space and time. I'll try and tr maybe try to not get lives over as well. In the process. <laughs> Yeah. I'm not kidding. Okay. Okay, we are serious. Got it, ma'am. Got it. Okay, we will. Maybe I should have mentioned I best. was only working the gate for one day. Oh well. <laughs> oh, that's true. Oh, that's true. We do not exactly. Will, will we go back there? It's getting pretty late. <laughs>
I should head home. Yes, let's go back home. Okay, um, should I save here or wait? Yeah, you know what? I think, I think I will just end this here for now. Okay, before we go any further into any other thing. So, yes, we will end this here right now. And should I go back to the main screen? Do you have that catchy title music? Let me see, let me see. Alright, so we are back in the title screen and let's talk about that game <laughs> oh my god i have a very very fun time being a guardsman a guardswoman yes together with lil okay we become like a really good duo partner yes and i think what really really catches me what really really makes me love this game is the way their story is written Okay, the dialogue, the voice actor, the jokes, okay? The jokes is what gets me. Although some of the jokes doesn't even come from the royal jester. I don't even know why he is there on the phone, <laughs> okay? He's just wasting my speed call button, actually, that, that royal jester. I think I have a personal grudge with him. And yes, so far, I'm not sure like what it is that I love the best. I think I love the whole puzzle mechanic, the whole interrogation mechanic, like deciding each person, like whether or not they are lying and are they being defensive about their purpose coming to the town, things like that. I really love it, okay? In some kind of way, it feels like I'm playing mind games with the NPC. Like, hmm, okay? You look suspicious, you sound suspicious, so maybe I shouldn't let you in, things like that. I love that, okay? It's really, really a fresh experience for me because as I mentioned, I did not play Paper, Please, and I don't know how the game goes. But from what I have seen, even in their Steam Store page, they mentioned the name game Paper, Please, yes. But so far, I feel like I really, really enjoy the gameplay. It's very unique in my opinion. I love it, little guardsman, and I'm looking forward to making more videos on this game. But unfortunately, that will have to end right here, right now. Okay, this video for now will have to end, and we will have to continue our playthrough in another video and in another time. And as usual, if you are interested with this game and you want to check out their game, so feel free to go to the link that I will put in the description. Yes, I always put their Steam Store link in the description. So you can go there and check them out. And if you feel like you want to play this game yourself, you can buy them or wishlist them, okay? While saving up money. Because of course, from what we have learned today in this game, money doesn't come for free. Unless you manage to figure out that a certain grandpa is bringing a bloody gold, a blood gold, yes, a blood gold with him, and you can confiscate it. That's one way to get rich real quick. But yes, I think that's it for now. I really, really enjoy the game. I love the dialogue. I love the joke. I fight so bad with the joke. I get to roast a lot, yes. I think it unlocks a roasting side in me. And once again, thank you so much to Hilltop Studios and Versus Evil for this opportunity for me to play this little guardsman. Best of luck to this game. And I actually follow their social media account and I saw that they received a lot of awards. And I think I can see why they deserve that award so much, okay? It's a brilliant game. Alright, and I'm looking forward to play it more. So, of course, if you haven't been subscribed and you want to follow along with my journey playing this game, don't forget to click on the subscribe button. And if you have anything that you want to say to me, whether, well, it's about the game or your own experience about the game, feel free to do so in the comment section and don't forget to like the video. Alright, 
Thank you so much for those of you who have watched until this point. I really, really appreciate it. I will see you in the next video.